my mindset on on fueling would 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 definitely have to had have has to change, right? Of course. I mean, without a doubt. And, and I talk about that on my channel. I tell them fuel management plays a close part with you being profitable. That can that can equate to your check being fifteen hundred to twenty four, twenty five hundred. You know, and and that plays a great deal. Uh, how you drive the truck? How, what speed you drive the truck at? How does your truck operate? Your 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 you know your inflation of, of your tires. You know to to get you a better fuel economy. You know things like that. You got to pay attention to all those things because at the end of the day. This is, what I, this is how I feel about it, man. If I can't pay my bills and I got to call my fiance and say, hey, babe, I can't pay uh, your, you know, the house note, that, that's a lot of weight on me, man. So when I do, when, when, I, when I know I got that type of weight, I, I interact every day like it's my last meal. Because in entrepreneurship, you got to think like that, man. You got to have that go-getter mentality. You know, it's not, it's not everything's not hunky-dory. And, and 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 that's why I leave my number. I start doing all my videos. I leave my number on my videos so people can call me. And I, I tell them, I say, hey, man, if you want to come over here, I put all the numbers on my video. Just run the numbers. See if it makes sense. If it doesn't make sense, then, okay, make, a, make an educated decision. It's not for you. But see if it's making sense. The first thing I ask, ask people now, I say, hey, I ask them about their background, how much experience they have. How are they financially? I asked them, what do you need? Like people call me and say, if I come over there, I'm not going to make money. I said, okay, what is your definition of money? And I, I explained to them that today's prices are not yesterday's prices. You know, uh, just in January, man, I did 4,000 miles and I came home with $6,300. If I do that same 4,000 miles now, I'm probably going to come home with, it depends on my average, because it's the difference. See, a lot of people don't understand. Super Ego has a no-force dispatch policy, right? So that means that you don't have to go nowhere you don't want to. But what people don't understand, that just because you live in the South and you want to be home every weekend, you're going to take a pay cut, because sometimes the lanes in the South are less profitable.